Hello guys, and um, I am back after two months of no recording. So I'll come back with a video, which is how to make a hyperlink in HTML. A hyperlink is when you like click on like a, so let's say there's a hyperlink like to Google or something that takes you to Google. It's basically kind of like a fast train that goes from website to website. So to do our HTML, we are going to use Visual Studio Code. Visual Studio Code is free, and you don't need any sort of like um, kind of computer for it. I mean, you do. You can get it from Mac OS, Windows, and Linux. And if you can see it down here for RPM or Ubuntu, I don't know if you can get Visual Studio Code on um, Raspberry Pi. And um, it's also, I think, approved by um, GitHub. So one, let's download it. Okay, so now once you downloaded it, you'll be taken to the welcome screen. Well, in the welcome screen, go to these four blocks, or what's about to be four blocks. It looks like there's also a keyboard shortcut, but this is the extensions. And what you're gonna get is called, sorry, live. Uh, just do the first one. I should say something about Ritwick Day. You just install, mind you, says uninstall. This is mostly for HTML and CSS, so as you can see. <coughs> so, Let's go back to this these files and um, just exit that. I'm gonna open folder, and I already have a folder. It's called. I mean, I'm gonna make one. It's gonna be called ML. Oops. Okay, and I'm just gonna open it. Once that folder is opened, you still see the starting screen, but just make a new file, index.html. And as I explained in the previous video, this little image comes up with like HTML encoding or something like that. You just press enter and then I'll automatically create it for you. And once that's created, I'm gonna put an exclamation mark, point or something like and press tab. This opens up a bunch of HTML code for you. So we're gonna change the title to whatever you want. So. And that's just gonna be the title. So here's where stuff get important right here. We're gonna put the code right here. It's same as the image one. It's only one line of code to make it simple. But, I think you have to write this manually. So you just put A and H R E F out calling it ref equals your website. So this one will be https slash slash google.com. And uh, let's get out of here and close it. Close tag and then You'll see once you close it, you're right here between the middle. Like you're right here between the middle of this tag and that tag. And right here, you're going to write whatever you want, like your thing to be underlined blue. So I'll put Google. And now that I got Google in there, this is how you run live server if you was. If you have installed it, you can either go to, I think it was, no, it doesn't have it up here. Well, you either double click or right click and open with live server, or you just do a command L O. Oh, you gotta do it fast, I think. Command L O. Yeah, it's just opening this, I think, if you want to manually run it. So. We open it in live server, you can see all this numbers and stuff come up and your name of the 
the name of the thing I named it, so, so it doesn't make any sense. But whatever you named it, it comes up like this. So if I press it, it takes me automatically to Google.